Gibraltar. The rock stands firm, despite Spain's efforts to bring disruptive pressure to bear on the tiny land that proudly flies the Union Jack. These were the scenes in Gibraltar last September when the people went to the polls to let the world know that they were British and intended to stay British no matter what Spain did or said. The referendum brought 95.8% of the electorate to the polling station. Out of 12,182 votes cast, only 44 were against Britain. But even that overwhelming majority was no solution to the Spanish claim that the rock was there. And eight months after Gibraltar's chief minister, Sir Joshua Hassan, announced that resounding pro-British vote, Spain has again stepped up its We Want Jib activities. In London, Sir Joshua and his deputy, Mr Peter Isola, were heartened by the government's strong line against the Spaniards' closing of their frontier to Gibraltar. British Foreign Secretary Michael Stewart made it plain that neither Britain nor Gibraltar would weaken under Spanish pressure. Spain, he said, was making a great mistake if it thought otherwise.